So we're here with the uh, Beat Stubbs Uber Hackers, and please state your name. My name is Lazaro Herrera. And um, so today we heard that you were going to be uh, showing what I would call a uh, blockchain art piece um, tonight at, at, a, at an event here in Wynwood in Miami. Can you tell us a little about it? Uh, a little bit so, about it. Um, it's, people call it an art piece, but it's just mapping the transactions that are occurring in real time uh, and linking them together. So uh, Tanvira actually had the idea uh, to use the WebSocket from blockchain.info to get some information, and then uh, I wrote a little bit of D3JS code to just um, to just show it in real time, so you can actually see transactions popping in and being linked. So can you explain a little bit what what these things mean? So and what's going every on dot here? is an address that is being used. Um, if an address was used as an input, it is labeled as green. If it is used as an output, it is labeled as red. And if it was used as an importer and output, it's yellow. And here you can actually see how address you use built some really interesting uh, graphs. Um, so this thing is going to be at, because right now for, for you uh, watching, uh, it's like the art month in Miami. There's all of these artsy events and galleries. So I, I believe this is going to be shown like in a huge screen tonight. Yeah. Right? So we, we, so what just happened there? New block? N no. no? Uh, every two minutes. Uh, we take a picture and store it for people who want to get a print. So we expand oh, the screen, cool. double the force so that you get so that it expands out, and then we take a picture and we store it, and you can go check that out yourself. We can give you the link so they can see real time what pictures are being generated. Yeah, it's going to be hosted in the uh, Bitcoin that Miami yeah. website. Bitcoin that Miami. Yes. Um, so can you tell us quickly the, the cheap plug here? Uh, what do you guys do? What is Bitcoin? Bitstop. Uh, Bitstop. Uh, Bitstop, we like to think of ourselves as financial creators utilizing the blockchain technology rather than the traditional banking institutions, which are pretty much isolated at this point, I like to believe. Uh, so that includes creating financial services, ATMs, allowing people to buy online or trade value online without needing to have any third party as a bank or any government telling them how they can spend their money or whatnot. So how, how has been the, the reception of, of your services uh, here in Miami? Well, without actually having any marketing done with it, um, all of our traffic has been word of mouth. People who are just coming, checking out the machine. Uh, as well, we're just trying to run a small beta test with it. Uh, but as of now, like we just hit over 400 transactions just two days ago. Wow. From a combine of 170 customers, so just by there we can see already that customers are returning. How, how many ATMs uh, is did this uh, happen with? Uh, just one. Just one. Just one. In one day, 400 just transactions, one. and no no marketing, just people telling each other, hey, there's a Bitcoin ATM in Winwood, in Winwood Cafe. Uh, so yes, so, so these guys basically uh, put the first ATM. They, they look like this. Uh, these are, I believe, the Lamasu uh, yes. models, uh, and. The, the beauty what, what they've done here is, is, is what's running in here. Uh, they, they, I, I believe these guys have the, the most sophisticated uh, platform for Lamatsu. So I bet you can also partner with them if you want to get some of that and run your own network. So thank you guys from BitStop. Uh, this is uh, Angel Leon from Diario Bitcoin.